Hi guys, and um, welcome back to another episode of Fine Foods Food Review, the show for food lovers and eaters alike. Um, now, today, um, I'm going to be reviewing this. Um, I'm not sure if this is like an exclusive item of food to the UK, but this is um, toast, which is cooked bread. And um, this is brown toast, but you can also get it in white, except I didn't have any in the house today, so I'm just going to review the, the brown one today. So um, let's just dive straight in and um, go for it. Mm. There's a definite crunch to it, followed by a, um, a sort of a smooth, or well, maybe not smooth, but definitely a soft center. Um, one thing I would say is it's a bit dry, and um, that that is an issue, but I think that that could be resolved. And um, in order to resolve that, I've actually got got a friend here who's bought me some. Um, so can you pass me that? Um, this is some. Um, it's like a cheese and chive tubed cheese, and um, we're just going to put some of this on the toast like this. Just squirt a bit on. And then um, I've also got a knife here, so I'm going to I'm going to spread it, and um, that way we get a nice even texture on it. And um, let's just give it a try right now and see if we've made any significant difference. That that really does make a lot of a difference. Um, it doesn't ruin the crunch of the toast. But it brings a new um, level of sweetness and um, sort of a nice uh, wetness to it, so it, it doesn't get too dry in your mouth. Um, it tastes like sort of processed cheese, but it's quite tasty, and that chive really comes out quite strongly in there. So um, I'm going to give that a 7 out of 10. And um, to wash that down with, um, I was on a bit of a low budget today, but I've got some... Um, 35p energy drink and um, um, let's just try that out right now. I've got a glass so that you can see what colour it is and um, let's let's just pour this in and see what it looks like. Um, it's quite a quite an energetic colour so I can see why they call it um, 35p energy drink. Um, now this may be quite similar to other energy drinks and I did try another energy drink in a previous episode but this might be better or worse. Okay, so let's try it out. Mm. Okay, um, I think that that's quite fizzy. It again, it's a sort of um generic energy drink flavour, but it's um it's really nice. Um, it's not quite as sweet as other energy drinks that I've had, and I'm not getting a very caffeinous kick from it. I'm not feeling more energetic or anything like that. However, um, I think maybe if I drank all of this, I would start feeling quite energetic. So I'm going to try have a little bit more and see if there's any noticeable effects. Um, honestly, I'm, I'm not really feeling anything. Um, it makes me burp a little bit because it's quite, quite gaseous. But other than that, there's no really noticeable effects. I'm not feeling any more energetic, but um, it might do that in a while. So we'll we'll see. But um, for the moment, I'm going to give this a five out of ten. But I might be subject to changing my mind in a few hours when it's metabolized. Okay, um, that's all we have time for today. So um, thank you very much for tuning in to Fine Foods Food Reviews. Uh, thank you to my assistant Josh who passed me the food and also bought me the food, apart from the drink which I bought for myself. And um, tune in next time when I'll be reviewing more food and I'll be, um, I'll be eating the food and I'll tell you if it's good food and then um, I'll tell you all about it and I'll um, make sure that you know if it is good to eat or not good enough. Okay, thank you very much, bye.